we come from Paris where we were born and raised. We are twins. So you want to keep going in your movie career? Yeah. People can tell you all the time, you're not French. If I lose, he loses so. <laughs> the difference between production in France and in States. They always take off my pants to know who is it. Who. <laughs> I want to ask them this typical questions for twins. <laughs> Did you ever trick your girlfriends? We feel more French here than in France. That, that's in France. We come from Paris, where we were born and raised. So we uh, moved to LA like uh, one year and a couple months, two months, two months, two months, months and three days and uh, three hours. <laughs> <laughs> we like the American cinema, so we we came here to keep going, but to to bring something special like a hybrid movie like a uh, French touch but still American movie so and I think we work good because what we did in one year we didn't did it uh, in two or three years in France. Mm -hmm. Where is your family originally from? Paris. Your uh, mom and dad was also born in no. Paris? No, our family, our ethnicity, my parents are uh, born in, in Morocco so we, we are the second generation in uh, in france yeah yeah second generation of immigrants so did they raise you uh, according some moroccan traditions when you were growing up yep yeah what kind if you can share something specific moroccan mm, food <laughs> 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 yeah, food obviously but uh, yeah we at home it was like traditional and outside, like in school with friends, it's a uh, French culture. So we really have this double culture, but it's it's still uh, complicated because everywhere we you go, you are an immigrant. Yeah. In France, we born over there, but we are immigrants. In Morocco, we are immigrants. So we it's still complicated. We don't have a, we don't have our place. Maybe on the in middle of the sea and even maybe <laughs> fish day can come oh what are you doing here <laughs> but still if you compare when you go to morocco do you feel like uh, it's your home mm, i don't think so we we were over there just a vacation not for living so two weeks we are a little bit happy to come back in France. Yeah, <laughs> oh, I see. Because we have a friend, we have everything in France, so mm -hmm. it's different. So we can feel more French, but sometimes it's hard because the people can tell you all the time you are not French, you know. We're citizens of the world. What was the first movie you shot? It was uh, it uh, yeah, 12, 12 years ago mm -hmm. between Paris and Iceland. Let me, okay. It was the I, first I'm gonna movie we did. I'm going to struggle to say it. Sakekyo? Yes, exactly. <laughs> you say, right? this is the I watched that short film and it was very touching. So it's a story about a man who learned the sign language mm -hmm. to be able to communicate with a, uh, with a deaf girl, right? Exactly. How you come up with that idea? Whose idea was that? Um, I watched a, a cartoon a long time ago about a story between a woman and a, and a guy. And I have this, this idea and I talk with Zisham and we wrote some things. 
we have as well this uh, kind to to write together that uh, people not used to do. We can write something uh, in same time, like we are in Google Drive, mm -hmm. and it's instantly. So mm -hmm. I I I wrote and he wrote under me. So we on wrote together in same time. Okay. So they. Writer, they don't used to do that because it's like writing room and they have to like uh, write something and send to another person and they work together. But we have this kind to work in s in same time together. So mm -hmm. I can correct correct him and he correct me in same times. And so, so we have some idea. If, uh, if you if you write some things, I can read and I can change immediately. If I don't like. Okay, but if you technically, if you write it down and you, how I'm just thinking, so you decide, okay, let's uh, write this piece of dialogue and you both start to do it. And then if someone doesn't like the other version, how do you, like, how do you win the one which is best? Do you fight at all or how, no, how is that? No, we talk in the same time. Yeah. So it's, it's really easy and fast. We don't have ego between us because uh, if I, uh, write something and he said, no, it's not good. We have to write, I'm okay. You said that you don't have ego between each other anymore. No. Is it always, no competition, no, is no it always ego. been like this? Because yeah. teenage time, brother, sisters, they all fight. They try to prove something. Teenage time, we're not that smart and like um, have great connection. So you guys never had anything like that? Zero competition between us. Yeah, if I win, he win. If I lose, he lose. So, <laughs> so yeah, we're we a team are, since we. They try. We they, they try always. The, that was the, the the thing, the the worst thing that uh, when we from babies, this thing. Oh, who is the better? Or who, if you fighting, who is uh, the the better? They try always to push against us, For but we uh, we mm -hmm. never had this thing. Oh, I'm the 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 the, 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 the winner or not? So yeah, is that's someone. What, can tell like who is the better. <laughs> yeah, like yeah, like that. It's <laughs> equal. It's <done. laughs> but you said that you started with YouTube with some funny videos. Yeah. And then did you go to uh, film school to study filmmaking or for acting? acting? Yes, we acting. we did uh, the best school of the France. The name is Cours Florent. I did to the actor studio in in France. But for for the, the for directing, no, we we, we learn on the set with the, be the 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 best. We learn with the best. With the so best, so we learn. I think we in the school we can learn nothing. Yeah, yeah. We always when on we are on the set, we are always asking stuff. So we're not just coming and just acting and leaving. So I'm always oh, what do you call that? What do you you do that? What what you do that? And why you do that and not do that? So we are we were always asking and learning and. different palette of color we are not like mm -hmm. under drama or not under like what is when we were only on comedy before we did so much comedy so much before. comedy we were only on comedy comedy and on we, youtube yeah, yeah. I, we, we i've seen it so it's about i think some of it is about how people from morocco adjust to French culture, how like how or how French people don't really understand like a small things, small facts about Moroccan mentality. Is it is it the one? Because I've seen a few. Uh, I wasn't able to translate because I, I, I just watched it in French and I figured maybe that's what it is. It's uh, it was like a mini mini series about uh, not really Moroccan. It's uh, more uh, from like uh, Muslim because mm -hmm. uh, uh, in Ramadan we have some kind of rules but uh, all people don't don't know like every rules that we have in Ramadan so it was kind of a mini series comedy showing uh, what we are not allowed to do uh, during the Ramadan but uh, uh, in uh, in uh, in yeah in 
comedy way, you know. So yeah. so it was like uh, something for people to learn more about culture and in staying uh, on, on comedy. So so yeah, we did million views on on this. It was same with we did yeah. that just uh, between friends, uh, friends, uh, friend, uh, friends, and. Yes, so many million the view between uh, Canada, Belgium, uh, yeah. all North Africa, Africa, area Africa, because there are so many uh, people speak French. So it was around the world, mm. and uh, yeah, um, we did a lot of interview for mm. every. Yeah, uh, we did like view. every. Uh, it was paper. like something famous, <laughs> and we uh, we started to, to do the the first movie just after this miniseries. Yeah, because. Uh, TV channel, they saw this uh, miniserie, and when they saw that, we uh, they hired us to to work on another like uh, series for for the TV channel, so national TV channel. So we did another. That's after that's that. great. That's yeah, like yeah. a dream way. Yeah. Yeah, 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 to start on YouTube and someone see yeah, your the, work. This and is the purpose, I think, of everyone to be uh, to be. Uh, see by someone big and to try to do something more bigger so so we did it <laughs> i know you already done some work in america and i was curious if you can tell if you see the difference between production in france and in states about production itself funding distribution as well what are the differences it's really different <laughs> really different. Yeah, um, my wife can start. <laughs> uh, the process yeah, the is process different. Is different. Like uh, for money, is really different because all money in France comes from the government. There is not, there is some, but it's like really, really little part of uh, private uh, financing. So every money comes from the government. It's like a really, a, there is like a process, long uh, process. like a long process. If you want to do a movie that take you like a, maybe one year just for to have money, without like a writing and and produ production. So so you have to write and you have like a lot of lot of thing to to do. Do you also have to have some connections in the, in the government, or you can just contact them and bring your story and see if they like it and if, if they want to fund it. Technically, Technically, no. but technically. But everybody know when you have a connection that can be always yeah, better. But it's kind of difficult because if you want money from the government, there is some rules. I, I'm going to make you like... Uh, Please don't say it's uh, an image. It's like you are going to the club for dancing and you arrive at the door and they just uh, tell you, I know you are not uh, used to come here. It's only for like uh, people who they used to come here. Okay. So you say, oh, but I need to come, for come one time for to <laughs> used to, to come inside. So it's kind of because if you want money from the government, you have to already make a movie who won a big award or who uh, was brought Select. by a channel okay so but if you don't have the money for to do in the, the first movie you can't do it the movie <laughs> so i feel like it's the same as you go to warner brothers here yeah you also have to show some work but how you can show your work if you haven't done anything yeah but so. in france it's it's the, the money from the government from the people the tax we pay the tax for that mm -hmm. but you pay the tax and when you want when you want to make a movie the government tell you no, you can because you need to, to make a movie is, first. It's, uh, private. it's private. That is not private. It's normally it's for it's for everybody. People, for everybody. Since I'm Russian and we have this kind of system as well, uh, I'm thinking about censorship right away. Do you is this thing exist in France censorship? If if you get money from the government, can they tell you? if there is something that they like really gonna forbid you to do, like the topic yeah. you should about the story. Yeah, because there is a lot of commission. Mm -hmm. And mostly right now it's really complicated because there is this uh, identity problem with immigrant and you know, there is kind of content they don't like 
and there is kind of content they like so so you can't really write what you want but you have to write what they like you know what i'm saying so it's a little bit what we left from france we we you like respect to yourself yeah or not we like to respect your uh, like or not i don't know uh, black people who who they are like a lawyer a doctor or arabic guy who who is some someone like really really and smart and he do like good thing on the movie but yeah in france it's kind you know mm. normally the black guys or arabic guys is terrorist you know oh, okay. no i don't know i'm not a terrorist or some things i want to be a superhero or to be a lawyer and we start to to to, to read just for that because we 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 were so tied to play the bad guys or something like even that. Even in acting, and we start to even in acting. Yeah. Always, our agent he just we refer we refer so many so many uh, things. We have to we have to, to play to a bad play guy like or terrorist, someone or who stole yeah. things or someone who is dealer or terrorist or so. We, we that's why we direct because we arrived at this point who. We, we need to change everything. We want to change and we want to, uh, to, uh, to read our story and what we like, so... But it's hard to... The people accept that. So when you directed your films, you also produced it financially? Yeah. Yeah. Every movie is. I see. So uh, like... Uh, for the second one, we involve like 400 people. I see. And what about the production itself? What are the differences? How how do you Yeah, I mean financing? when you when you're already shooting, have you noticed that it's somehow different here? Maybe the schedule, maybe just the production process by itself, the shooting day. It's different um on time because in France we used to shoot really fast. Like uh in France, we can we can shoot something in three days that we're supposed to shoot in one week. Supposed to? Oh, okay. So we 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 used to, uh, and we just feeling a little bit here. People they are a little bit uh, lazy. not lazy, <laughs> but they they not no not the, not lazy cost, because cost, uh, it's, it's because yeah. it's because uh, the process is different. So like uh, for an example. Like they, there is a lot of department. They have assistant of assistant of assistant. Something Should like if I ask way, you, can you give me just uh, this tripod? They will say, oh no, you can't ask me. You have to ask the this, assistant. this person who are gonna ask this person who are gonna ask this person. So in France, they even like a uh, makeup. She can bring this tripod and give you and win time. So there, there is not this kind of uh, ego. Mm -hmm. It's like we we had. Yeah, in like uh, in low budget, maybe in big, big, big uh, movies, they have as well this kind of department, but less than here. Here, it's a lot of, they have a lot of, uh, if you see like just in credit, like the credit is like uh, three minutes of credit and you can see like uh, they, ha they are like maybe 10 people for to do uh, like a work for five, uh, of five people. Mm -hmm. But I think they have, and that's why I had like he say it's, a Movie that are really expensive here. Like uh, we can, I think we, we can do in the same movie for maybe uh, just uh, thirty percent of the yeah. the money. And what is the approach when you both direct? I you know you guys said that you don't have ego uh, for each other, but when you are on set and you still have to make these decisions to to let this creative process flow. Um, we so don't have the process. We just uh, look you at each other. You just read each other's minds, okay. We just look at each other <laughs> and we don't have like, a, you take a care of that, I take a care of that. No, it's natural. It's go, I go. It's, it's, it's not, uh, it's natural. You said you've been here for uh, one year and something. Yeah. One year something. Did you feel like you have uh, language barrier when you moved here yeah. in English? When I arrived here, I didn't speak English, nothing. How did you overcome it? 
but your English, I told you that already before. Yeah. Your English <laughs> is so good for for person who been here for such a short period of time. When you don't have a choice, you need to, to learn in that city. It's and we went to school. It's, it's <laughs> like it's like you need to survive. So my first month, uh, <laughs> I was uh, I was like dead. <laughs> And yeah, I tried every day, and uh, I, I I was go uh, going in uh, in school too. So language yeah. school in yeah, like a couple of months. Yeah, we we had like eighteen hours per week of English okay. class. Okay. So yeah, we spent uh, like a uh, lot of months over here. So, but uh, it's still complicated. You have to to learn it, the most uh, complicated is, is, is it was uh, to doing everything in the same time when we were here we, we didn't have the, the social number credit score document car and we have we had we had everything in the same time so the first month it was <laughs> nightmare <laughs> When people move here, it's also can be difficult to learn English because language barrier is tough. So they try to communicate more with people who speak their native language. It's yeah, this is the worst the thing. Worst thing you can it's do. the worst thing, yeah. but people do it because it's a comfort zone. And we and we did that. <laughs> yeah, we did it. Okay, so I was like, I want to ask them this typical questions for twins. <laughs> you know, like you you certainly know there's like. I think you can make a list of it, like the questions people usually ask you, but I think people are going to be curious when they see you. So I still like, okay, I'm going to go for it. And like, I, I literally made this list over here. So I'm just like, <laughs> go to read it. So who is older? Who is younger? Me, three minutes. You older? Yeah, three, three minutes. minutes. Three minutes. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> How to recognize one from the other? You have uh, one chance on two. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Okay. Yeah, I'm a, he's a little bit more taller than me. So, mm -hmm. five centimeters. <laughs> five? Yeah. And I have a birth, birth uh, mark on my leg. Okay. So, okay. when I was a kid, People take off the, the always the pants. they take off me. Uh, no way. Yeah, really? the family because when we, we when we did like, the school show, uh, like uh, it's bad not thing, just family. they have to know who did it. So they always take off my pants to know who is it. Who. <laughs> when we were kids, even my family, my mom, my sister, brother, they don't know who is it who. Like the bracelet from the hospital. The hospital, yeah. I have it like long time because you know, baby, we were like. Same you can, way. and I'm sure sometimes I, I think maybe it's me, Sammy. <laughs> it's not him. Because I'm sure just, uh, one day they just change and they, they don't know who is it who, and they say, okay, you are Sammy. Isham. Okay, today you're Sammy. <laughs> so I'm sure, so, but uh, yeah, we. we are but if you call me Isham, I cannot tell you. Uh, yeah, 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 for me, if I heard, hey, Samir, I'm going to, to show tell myself. Can. So. Did your uh, mom dress you in the same? Clothes and you were ch children. Oh yes. Yeah. Really no, long time. during long time. time. <laughs> okay. When did it stop? Do you remember? <laughs> mm, maybe yeah, 10, 10, 10, 10, 11, yeah. 10, 11, 10, 11. Did you like it? Like, no. Do you no. remember? No. no. We <laughs> was, we were like uh, alien. You know, everybody. Yeah. Oh, twins! Oh, yeah. twins! Oh, yeah, yeah. Twins. Always the, the, the thing was, that I'm always. It was a little bit uh, weird. It was that. Oh. Another one. Um, so, did you ever trick your girlfriends? Mm. Oh, you look at, oh, you look at me. <laughs> <laughs> you look at me like... <laughs> no, I'm like, no, I don't Or think like, so. did you ever switch places? Yeah, yeah, all the time. Yeah. School place, yeah. The class. Yeah. I we, sh we shared the, the, the school when, when we, uh, we were kids, because the, the, sc the school acting, it was so expensive. And we shared the, the same uh, same place. I I went one day and he, uh, he went one day because it's really expensive. And they didn't know. No. So you registered as one person. Yeah. Yeah. And That's we great. did like uh, one day and he did one day. It was, it's kind of school for people who have money. 
Mm-hmm. We don't have. A, we don't have. We come from the poor family, so we work it for to pay this school. Yeah, so we work together, like after school, to pay one scholarship. So uh, one day it's for me, one day it's for him. So we change. And was there? Never know. Was there an exam? I did it. <laughs> <laughs> okay. okay. I you did, did it. it? Yeah. <laughs> I see. Since we almost going to the finish of the interview, I want to um, get back to filmmaking and ask you an important question. Um, what is the most important purpose for you in filmmaking? Why do you do it? Not for money, yeah, obviously, <laughs> because there is no money on this uh, industry or if you are on the top. But uh, we, uh, I think our purpose is just to, to live with what we love. Yeah, and, ch- and change, uh, change the mind of the people with, with our story. I think when you, we wrote some story, we need to tell some things with a message. Message? Message. 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 And uh, we can do it like just movie for doing a movie. Okay, it's nice to make a Marvel action movie. But we prefer to doing like a social movie, like drama, something deep, with, with some things that you can learn on the end. You can grow up with this movie. I, I, think, I think it's a cultural movie. We, all, all the movie we did, uh, there are some things inside. You can learn some things. And uh, we're not feeling uh, working. When you love what you do, do what you love, and you will never work. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Do you like Marvel? We grew up with the Marvel, so yes, we love the Marvel and uh, comics, DC. I think it's a dream to doing one day uh, a Marvel or something like that. But I don't think so. It's the movie uh, with you can Thinking, or like it's this like movie, it's not like chill movie. movie. You know? It's a, uh, it's blockbuster, you know. So there is not like a deep story on, on kind of movie. You know, it's a kind of movie, too easy to watch it. You can, watch it and, and do something, as well. <laughs> mm-hmm. Yeah, like clean the apartment. <laughs> <laughs> um, there are three questions we ask everybody. Um, in the interview, and I want to ask you too, uh, if you can name a few pieces of art which influenced you um, while you were growing up and influenced your personality. It can be a movie or a scene from, from a movie. It can be a song or a painting, a book, for example. We are uh, this generation of uh, 80s movie. And I think we are really lucky, really lucky to 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 born in this uh, past ten years, because uh, we had chance to grow up with a uh, like crazy movie that we don't have anymore today, like uh, E.T. Back in the Future, Goonies, Gremlins, uh, Gremlins uh, Jumanji, all that kind of movie. We grow up uh, with the, those movies. It's uh, like uh, the first time. Uh, when we were to uh, to the theater, it's to, to for to watch the those movies. So we had this big influence in, uh, on this movie. So I think it's uh, this movie who give uh, give us this envy to to do this uh, this work and uh, books. I think uh, Romeo plus uh, Romeo and Juliet. <laughs> We are really fan Shakespeare, Molière, Shakespeare. Fedo. Uh, we learn this classic, uh, this classic on the school. So school and acting school, theater. Yeah. So, so we did we did the theater too. How immigration changed you? Which one? <laughs> yeah, this one, the last one, the one to the Which US. One? Yes. Even we, uh, we we was born to uh, we were born to Paris. Uh, we still uh, immigrate. So. It's it's funny because we 
We feel more French here, here than in France. That, that's in France. It's, it's weird. Here, everybody considers us French, French, but not in France. What is that to be French to you? For me, to be French, it's born in Paris, uh, grew up with this culture. For me, yeah. but not for the, like, a real French. For me, it's, to it's like bullshit to, do, to, to be like, I'm French, you're not French. Why? Because your parents were born in France and not my parents? It's, it's weird to, to hear that. Mm. If you're born and you go to the school since your, your birth and you have this culture and you, you pay understand, your tax, you, you pay, pay your tax <laughs> and you understand the all uh, French culture and we are really proud to be French and Moroccan because uh, I'm proud to, the, uh, uh, to say uh, I'm, I'm um, French Moroccan. I have uh, two, uh, two culture and... It's a richest for me. Yeah, even to speak French, it's uh, something that uh, I'm proud. But the immigration, for to come back to your question, yeah. the immigration here, it's, uh, for to be honest, for me, everybody is immigrant here, even American. But the people don't know that. <laughs> even American, they are immigrant. But it's a, it's a new country. Yeah, uh, yeah, you you spent here, I know it's not a long time, but still one year, um, it's, still, it's still time like, to maybe you feel like some perception about the states changed inside of you or maybe even about yourself? Ah, I think we are still learning about uh, America because we are not objective. Los Angeles is really, really different between, uh, between other cities. Yeah. And it's kind of a big brother uh, TV show here. We are not feeling to, uh, to living to living it's on the real life. It's a reality TV show here for me. It's not like just we just come back from. It's still in Cali California. Uh, we went to Huntington Beach and we felt that Another life is, yeah, different. is different. We <laughs> felt like time. to be uh, like a real in, a, in real America because, uh, yeah, here everybody is in industry. Everybody is actor. Everybody is producer. Everybody is director. Everybody you can go everywhere. The Uber driver he is actor. You can uh, the the uh, on the, the restaurant the waitress is an uh, actor as well. Oh, you can go oh, I'm as well uh, the producer. I'm uh, as well. Everybody is an, an industry, so we are. Everybody kinda, wait, you know. <laughs> so real. everybody they're working, but they they waiting. Everybody is like on two chair, you know, to have one part of. But your it's good to, to believe uh, on dream, but it's but it's like a movie, a big movie. Everybody is ready. <laughs> to, to, <laughs> to play shoot. <laughs> yeah, and it's, yeah. it's, it's great, uh, but it's weird. We, we, we don't have that in Paris. And we're feeling like people, they are not living, uh, they're not real. You know, they constantly playing, they acting uh, something. So sometimes I want to, to say cut and just to uh, live the real life. Do you feel like you have to adjust to that? Do you feel like since people wear these masks, do you feel like you sometimes too straightforward and honest for this environment in Los Angeles? And do you have to adjust? Yeah, yeah. you can't be as you are in France. Here you have to be, you know, they all are, oh, it's nice to see you, I love you, and I miss you, I miss you. and I never say that to, uh, to uh, in France. The someone. people can tell you, I love you, like the first day, I love you. For the French people, maybe for the Russian people, uh, American people can say like French people or Russian people can be cold. But we are not cold, we just know what is uh, you can know when you can open your heart or not. You, can, you can't open your heart for, for everybody. And I think uh, if someone from Europe can tell you I love you, it's for real, or I can tell you like I'm your friend, you can call me at four in the morning, I can come in. So it's weird, you, someone can tell you, oh, you're my friend, I love you, I miss you. And tomorrow, oh, uh, nice to meet you. You, I meet you just yesterday. It's, it's really weird. Like one day, it's just one day. 
It's not like no, a couple, couple of hours. <laughs> a couple of hours too. <laughs> it's it's weird. So we it's different culture. We, so I think we. But we have to adjust. We have to say as well. Uh, yeah, I love you too. I love you too. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And I miss you too. Yeah, I love you too. I miss you too. But uh, I'm not going to say first like. Uh, yeah, I'm stay polite. So if someone tell me I love you, I'm like, yeah. Me too. Uh, me not too. I love you. Me too. <laughs> yeah, yeah, me too. <laughs> but uh, yeah, but uh, I'm more, I, I can say more, I appreciate you than I love you. But this culture can, can be um, lovely uh, in the first plane. When everybody smile, everybody uh, make a cuddle, everybody can be uh, lovely. <laughs> Because when we come back to, <laughs> we, when we came back to France, For Christmas. And, uh, for Christmas. It was really weird. So Because when I arrived we in Paris, I'm smiling for everybody. And, and the people so, they were <laughs> thought like, I'm, I'm crazy. Like, why are you smiling with everybody? <laughs> so it's nice. Mm, and yeah, you, know, you a little bit miss it. So when you are in Paris, you know, everybody is working. Everybody is running. So no one watching you or smiling you. You feeling like, oh. It's kind of nice to, to everybody can smiling be, uh, and nice like friendly and they are... That can be fake, but with a pleasure. <laughs> the last one is what is home for you and where is it? In France or in America or I, in Morocco? I think we can... That everywhere in the world that can be a, a home, I think. We just need to be uh, comfortable and now in my apartment, I feel so good because I build this, this bubble. So I think it depends with you are. With who you are. Yeah. And uh, if you feel comfortable, that's it. I can be, my home can be here, it can be. In yeah, Africa, it's, in it's Russia, funny because you are happy to come back world. to Paris, but after you are happy to come back to Los Angeles. So I think it's kind of our goal to have like half and half, you know, to be here and when you are enough, <laughs> you just want to come back in Paris. And when you are in traffic in Paris, everybody, they are like, do you want to come back in Los Angeles? <laughs> 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 Or when it's rainy, we are like, oh. I miss sun in Los Angeles, even we don't have a lot of sun this uh, month. <laughs> yeah, it's coming. Yeah. It's coming. Yeah, it's summer. Thank you guys for watching. Please subscribe to our channels, uh, send us likes, your love, and we really appreciate your attention and your likes help us grow. Thank you so much. Thank you.